Duke tonight at 10, local leaders getting ready to enforce Governor Abbott's most recent order regarding the coronavirus. No groups of any size should be gathering anywhere now, and the only exception is churches. However, they're limited to just 10 people, and they also have to practice social distancing. Our, Keth, our Seth Kovar has more now on that order and what it means for our parks and beaches here in the Coastal Bend. It's all the more reason to do what I'm doing most of the time, staying at home. While the beaches remain open and the parks as well right now, local leaders say if we continue to group up on them, they may go the way of other cities and close them. Come out here, who get, uh, get to know everybody, try to make friends while we're out here doing it. The newest stay-at-home order means changes here at Islander Pavilion. The lights will go out at dusk, and soon signs will go up, ordering park users not to group up. It means no more pickup games and only solo shoot-arounds. It's kind of a bummer, but I understand what, what's going on in the world and uh, what they have to do to keep everybody safe. We're social people by nature, so it's going to have a huge impact. A social impact, and for Dean Konziolka, a financial one as well. He trains talented young swimmers at the beach for now with all the pools closed. But there are 25 of them, and they're no longer supposed to get together for practice. It makes um, it very difficult to try to get any kind of basic training in on any level because we're so restricted with all of the facilities being closed. Coronavirus restrictions are difficult on everyone, but local leaders say they're necessary. I think this is going to be yet another adjustment in this new world we find ourselves in, but clearly the governor is being driven by data to make these policies. Now it's just a matter of watching how closely the no groups policy is enforced. And if that happens, some folks say they just get back on the court as soon as the cops drove away. Once they leave, I'm playing again. But others say they'll play by the rules. I'm not one to go against uh, whatever, you know, they got going on. If that's what it says, then, you know, and they have certain restrictions over what we can do here, then that's what, I, you know, that's what I'll obey. Local leaders say when it comes to basketball courts, really all we should be doing is practicing our free throws by ourselves. And at the beach, you and your family can enjoy the day in the sand and surf, only avoid other groups of people. Reporting in Corpus Christi, Seth Kovar, Chris 6 News.